Hey, welcome to today's MCAT question of the day. As always, we'll be working our way through one of the many MCAT practice problems found at MCATSelfPrep.com, the home of the free MCAT prep course. I'm Krista, a 99th percentile MCAT tutor, and today I'll be walking you through today's problem as though you were one of my private tutoring students. Today's problem comes from lesson four of the chemistry two module. Be sure to pause the video, try the problem out for yourself before listening to my explanation. All the carbocations are going to have a positive charge on that carbon. In order to stabilize that positive charge, attached to the molecule needs to be electron donating groups. So let's go through all the molecules and figure out which one would yield the most stable carbocation. First up, we have carbon with two nitrogens and a hydrogen attached to it. Nitrogen is more electronegative than carbon, so it's going to pull the electron density away from carbon, making the already positive carbon more positive which reduces its stability. Next up, we have three chlorides attached to the carbocation. Just like nitrogen, chloride is more electronegative than carbon. The electrons that are within the molecule are gonna hang out more around chloride than carbon, making that central carbon even more positive. Then we have a carbocation carboxylic acid. Oxygen is once again more electronegative than carbon, and acts as an electron withdrawing group. Last but not least, we have three hydrogens attached to a carbon. Now, unlike before, hydrogen is way less electronegative than carbon. The electrons that are found within the molecule are gonna hang out around carbon rather than hydrogen because that carbon is electron hungry. This is gonna help stabilize the molecule because the hydrogens are going to donate their electrons to the positive carbon. Thus, D is the correct answer, as it is the only one with electron donating groups. If you enjoyed this MCAT question of the day, give us a follow and go check out MCATSelfPrep.com for more tips, tricks, and resources on how to ace your MCAT.